All right, guys. So today I'm going to be going over the trick uh, that I did a performance for the uh, prediction card trick. Um, before I do that, um, I just want to say that I've already picked a winner for the deck giveaway, and I will message you. Um, also, um, I've seen a few comments asking me to do things such as like a ribbon spread or how to hold cards in my hand uh, or in your hand. I mean, just because they're so beginner, um, I'm not going to post them on my channel because a lot of you actually wouldn't benefit from it. But if you are a beginner and you do think you need that extra help, uh, make sure to click on the link. I would highly advise anyone to actually do that. Um, it's going to help you guys out a lot. But anyways, guys, here is the actual video. All right, so before I go into the explanation, um, I would go ahead and advise you to click on the link here. Check out the tutorial, or actually the performance, and that way this is going to make a little more sense to you guys. Uh, so basically, um, I started off the trick by having, let's say I could have had the spectator shuffle up the deck of cards here. And um, really, this is just a marked deck, so I actually just knew, I actually know all the cards um, just from looking at the back. So if I look at, let's say this card, for example, um, I can pick it up, and this is actually going to be the ace of clubs. So I flip it over as you can see this is the ace of clubs. So it's really simple. Um, I'm going to make a couple videos in a series going over a few tricks that you can actually do using a marked deck. Um, so anyways guys basically the, the principle here is as you can see the pips here um, you can see I've actually colored out one of them with a red sharpie so instead of it having a full circle you can see this one is actually colored in at the top and also on the right here in this little circle on the very right um, I have the farthest pip to the right colored out red you can barely see it um, and it was, this is going to be uh, the nine of hearts so I can flip it over and show you uh, just by looking at the pips I'll teach you guys how to read these um, in a separate video but basically I'm just explaining the trick so um, the spectator picked any card from the marked deck all I did was pull the card out of the deck here and push it up and I said I leave it on the table this way no one can see the card and as I'm pushing it out I'm reading the card and I can see here that I have these seven of clubs and then while the card is still face down I go over here in the deck and this is actually an invisible deck so the spectator really could have picked any card uh, the card lays down flat here I know it's a seven of clubs so all I'm gonna have to do is open up to the six of diamonds here so I'll go through and show the spectator that there's one card face down and that is going to be the seven of clubs so uh, tricks really simple guys um, but anyways like I said I'm going to be going into um, some more explanation for the mark deck um, anyways I hope you guys like the video and as always thanks for watching